Welcome to the other Kentish town. A station that was supposed to be called Castle Road. Opened in 1907. And it only lasted 17 years in service. Today, we're at South Kentish Town. In this week's episode. It was deemed important enough to have a tube station, and then it only lasted 17 years. I'm going with a firm nine out of 10 so far. This has been here for 115 years. Oh, look. Oh my God. Look. Wow, oh. what? It's another cliffhanger. Holy moly! Well, that was pretty awesome, right? This passageway is for LT access to the air well only. It is not a public right of way. Wow. You read that beautifully. Thank you. You could do voice service. <laughs> you should, you should really try it. Radio yeah, Pro. Yeah, you could do this, buddy. You could do that. Oh, no. oh what are the key moments? Oh, and that was one of my eyes. This is, so uh, this is the tradesman's entrance to <laughs> Castle Road. Yeah. Trades. It is. Heavens above. Not oh, three, not three times and ask for Alex. Yeah. God, look at this. This very um, oh, wow. atmospheric. This lighting. Uh, wow. okay. Yeah. Okay. Wowzers. Okay. We need some torchage. Yep. Let's double check this is not on this camera, is it? It is. We've picked a day for it, guys. Oh, wow. Wowzers. Oh, my goodness. Look at this. Right, so it's a toss-up between whether it's grimmest out here or yeah. in there. Ooh. This, uh, is, this is really cool. Chilling. I, I'm really it is quite cool. impressed by I'm this. I'm really excited <laughs> because I've never been here. Hang on, none, none of us have been here, right? None of us have been here. This no. is a newbie for Proper all of us. Proper exploration, this Ooh. one. That torch is going to get warm there. <laughs> Um, there we go. There we go. Well done. As ever, these doors are alarmed, and so will we be once we see what's inside. Yeah, there I'm we really go. Worried. Let's do this. I've got my rubber gloves. Anyone else need rubber gloves? Yeah, I've got some here. Oh, good grief! Look at this. Oh, finally. Oh. In you go, Lord. Look at this. It's a bit puddly. Oh, bit puddly. Look. It's absolutely filthy. Oh. oh. I mean, so, we were, we have been warned. <laughs> oof. Well, this is quite extraordinary, isn't it? Is, is it windy? <laughs> This is incredible, and oh, looking at the oh map, God, we're actually filming? not sure. Yeah. Oh, um, sorry. We're not actually sure what on earth we can do here because it's actually such well, a it, it, strange site, and the, the, the plans that we look at are not necessarily indicative of things that we. Would I, I mean, in fairness, that's quite a hard plan to decipher, uh, and gives you a sense of just how much grime there is here. Um, well, From I think what I can read on that plan, it says that there's a ladder down to yeah. platform level, which um, might be a problem for us. Do we have a look and see? Well, I think we should. I mean, we're here now, so right. why not? Come on, Sybils. Right, we'll put on the <laughs> Are you enjoying this, Law? I mean, on a, on, a, on a scale of one to ten, I think I'm at a one <laughs> right I mean, now. You're looking less tube explorer and more polar explorer <laughs> right now. It's, it's, it's working for you. I literally said to Chris before that I should have worn thermals today because I'm that cold. It's because we've just been rained on as well, so the cold <laughs> breeze is not helping. Yeah. I've got cold little hands too. And they've, they've gone so cold, they've gone they've green. Got, green. <laughs> I've lost the colour in them, <laughs> but they have gone with my favourite colours. <laughs> Right then, let's do it. This way. Um, good news, there's a spiral staircase. Hooray! I figured that was the case. I've not heard any mention of a ladder. There's probably a ladder as well. Do you remember when we visited uh, Kentish Town and we saw that sawn off ladder? I suspect they've got one of those here. Oh, yeah. Neighbouring stations often do similar Sim malarkey. Wow, look at this. Yeah, wow! He's big. It, it is. That's extraordinary. Oh. Wow. This is, yeah, this is something else. Ooh. Sids, yeah. Alex, first Hello. impressions. Uh, dirty, dark, um, probably one of the more primitive places we've been. It's very echoey. It feels very much like off the grid. Yes. It's not been, you know, used to, it's given me sort of a sense of like, very abandoned. What's going on there? Well, I'm going to say rails and vents. It's, it's just <laughs> a long, long drop. There's yeah. A 
Yeah, so this is the vent, this is the vent, isn't it? Wow, look at the roof though. You yeah. know, right, do you know we've talked, sorry, the ceiling rather, not the roof, what am I talking about? Yeah, we've talked about this before, haven't we, about this kind of rough cast shuttering. Here comes a train, can you feel the wind? Oh, I certainly can. This is like, it's like a sense of a tomb almost, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it is. This is, um, rather than being buried in a pyramid. Yeah, this is very... <laughs> Well, it's one of the most atmospheric places I've been to for yeah, a while. It's incredible, Chris, actually. Chris, come and join us. Yeah, I will. I just wanted to capture the sense of the scale of it from up there. Yeah. It's, it's incredible. It's... So, so oh. shall we... Um... Here comes train. Yeah, let's, let's see if we can just be careful with the we light. Can't, so we, we won't see the trains from here. This is the lift shaft, I'd say, so... Should we, should we head in? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Do this. Should I lead you on? Yeah. You generally do. Let's do this. Are we ready, guys? Hey! Oh my goodness, the wind! Cool, the wind is absolutely phenomenal. Are you okay? Wow. They're getting blown back out the door. Are you alright? And they're out again. <laughs> is that alright, Sid? It just we have to wait until because that is immense. This is like a wind tunnel. It's like a it proper reminds wind. me is it mask somewhat time? Uh, of it might well North be, End. It yeah. is like North End for that kind of almost as oppressive. Certainly as dirty. No, this is, this is that was windier than North End, right. I would say. Oh well, Thank look forward to right. that. All right. right. Okay, okay, let's do it. Quick, quick, quick. You are right? <laughs> you ready? Yeah, oh, oh wow. <laughs> oh no, we, second wave, Chris. We need to go in the Whoa. first wave. Second train. Yeah. Oh dear. Oops. Well, that, I mean, they're, they're lost now. We might as well. We've got it's all nice the lights. <laughs> Gee whiz, Should we just go is, back up? <laughs> that is intense. Oh my goodness. It reminds me a little bit. <laughs> I mean, this isn't going to be coming over on camera. It is like, I don't know, Gale Force 10, isn't it? I can, I can hear Siddy. I can't, just can't quite. I'm loving the uh, kind of the Juliet Library stairs there. Do love a spiral stair, yeah. don't we? Right. Do you think it's safe now? <laughs> I'd say our time is now. <laughs> Let's do it. Oh, wow. It's more Juliet stairs. Oh, crumbs. Oh, there's another train. Ah. Uh, what is it? Oh, wow, this is a very regular service. Man alive. This is like, I feel like when we went and did the crystal maze, it wasn't as intense as this. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Uh, this is an assault on the senses. And more brown tiles. Brown and maroon. Okay. Oh my. Oh, all right. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. There's cool. just. <laughs> right. Cool. Let's, like, hang on. Let, hang let's on. Just, hang let's on. Let's just take a moment. <laughs> that was quite an assault getting down those stairs. It's wasn't the it? wind. It's the dirt. It's the fear of the unknown, actually, because yeah. we don't know really what we're going to see down there. Never here. been here before, but my. I've, I once looked at the station plan of here and, oh, well, oh, Laura, let me take that. Sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is yeah. just incredible. So, uh, so just like its neighbour at Kentish Town. WBC's and Sons. Ooh. But also look at... Um, a little bit hot. You're right. Yeah, better? that's lovely. Look at that. Like, isn't that just that fantastic? That is gorgeous. And of course, this is proof that this was the entrance to the lift shaft that we just walked in. Yeah. Yeah, and... Do you remember at Kentish Town, it was, that was a venture after 87, I think. Mm -hmm. And here we go. 88. It's 88. Next one up the line. And it's quite a yeah, reasonably deep shaft, isn't it? That's, that's kind of typical, typical of what you, you get on. And again, beautiful early tiles, you know. So again, it just that. goes to show that in the, because I was looking at the designs of each of the station's tiles, the colors are similar, but the designs on the platform are different. That is proper eerie, isn't it? If you didn't know what that was, wouldn't you need a change of You'd clench. <laughs> You'd be clenched. Yeah. Um, I, and also, of course, it's worth saying that there's this enormous uh, fan here. Fanage. Yeah. Centrifugal, I think. Yeah. So, that is, so that's the thing that will draw air in and out of the tubes. Yeah, I guess it doesn't, it doesn't really need to be running at this time of year because it's quite cold. So uh, look through there. Yeah, well, that's the other side, side of the. Yeah. 
the lift shaft. So, yeah. um, thankfully, we are authorised. So, should we should we just drop down? I and don't know if we can, can we get back. No, I don't think we can get across. But I'm just kind of curious across, to see what we can do. Yeah. Do um, wow. Chris, is it giving you city road vibes? It, do you know exactly that? Right. Exactly that. That I mean, that was. Again, another assault, assault wasn't on the it, senses. Laura? I mean, the, but was... this, this section where you could see between the two, I mean, you could actually go from each side at that point, but just that initial uh, kind of section coming in then just really reminded me of that site visit as well. You are right, Sydney. There's something about the ha kind of a howl it's the almost, sound. isn't there? Yeah. It sounds it's different. Kind of rail singing? Yeah. It's very, um, it's eerie. It's got like a sense of... Forebode. <laughs> That's <laughs> forgotten. That howl. What was that, what was that story you were saying about? Because I, I think to really feel the atmosphere of this place. What's the Betjeman story? Oh yeah, so. Um, he wrote a piece of prose in 1951 called South Kentish Town. And it was a fictional piece um, about somebody getting trapped in the disused section. Um, and it was taken from a real situation where a train was being operated uh, and the doors accidentally opened. Um, but obviously nobody became trapped in, in the real world in that situation. But this uh, piece that Betjeman wrote kind of you know, takes strands of that and talks about somebody being trapped down here. It's incredible. Can I just say, I love the atmosphere of doing this with this light. It's like telling ghost stories dun, around dun, the dun, campfire. Dun. It really is. It really is. <laughs> and, and to set the history of this, yeah. this the station opened um, in 1907. June 1907. Yeah. And Closed it had, in 1924. So 17 years. Yeah. So it was part of the general what? strike that it closed down, and then it just never opened. Really? And general of service hours, so it's like the power effectively went off, and then they thought, you know what, not enough yeah. people are using this station, we're not going to reopen it. If, if you remember, uh, we've done previous episodes about stations which closed in general strike, like York Road, but the difference yeah. is they reopened after a bit of protesting, and then closed again. And then closed but, again. <laughs> but, I mean, for those fans of... Industri fans. fans of fans uh, of industrial equipment. Man alive! Look at that. It's that got would have some clo size clothes on it. dry in about if two minutes, wouldn't it? On, we would be in trouble. Be oh yeah, no, it'd be bad news. Uh, I just want to see if I can get the camera back up to the top. It's a shame you just won't get a sense of the scale yeah. if you're watching this at home. But I mean, it is. Um, Maybe if I get just, Alex if I get you guys it, it into shots, yeah. I'm five foot seven. <laughs> Yeah, uh, I'm just trying not go. to trip over. Idea. Look I'm at that! Absolutely <laughs> Look at that, folks. It's Don't huge. you always stand next to you? Well, no, you're taller than me. <laughs> I'm, I'm looking up at her because she's a bit taller. <laughs> uh, it's, uh, so there we go. That is the lift shaft. We ought to have a look over here, then, Nixie, didn't we? Because yeah. Let's go. I'm, I'm, I'm just oh. being thorough because I can see this side's caged yeah. off. Here we go. In case we've got any... If your ears pop, kiddos, put fingers in your ears. Fingers are a bit dirty, it's well, a tiny bit is. protected down here. It was just on that stairwell, was wasn't the stairs, it? It was just so noisy, wasn't it? But look, I mean, it's incredible that all the tiles still exist. I'm itching to get nearer to the trains. Oh, hey guys. Yeah. Found you another one. Another one? Yeah. This one's got a beautiful layer of dust and grime on it. Do you want it that's cleaned up or no, do you no, 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 authentic no. I think, dust? I think that's almost better. Oh, and hey, look, Big Scary Fans started running itself. Oh. <laughs> it's incredible. That's always fun, isn't it? It's that Do you remember Moorgate City? Yeah. <laughs> that biggest fan we've ever seen. That was... <laughs> Sorry, my torch wasn't doing anything there, was it? Though, the tiles, it's just incredible. It's all in... I mean, it's all very, very crusty, but it's in other ways in a really quite good shape, isn't oh, it? The mouldings are there and most of the tiles look are there. All of this, the cornice work. Yeah. Yeah, we're literally just looking at that then, Alex. That's tremendous. Oh, hello. This is what we like. Bit of uh, modification. Mm. So there's another big shop here. Oh, Alex. Look hello. This, and look, there's another maker's tile. This, I've never known... So many! <laughs> this, is, this is all so preserved. It's almost this, like... Nixon. You know, the oh. only other place is Piccadilly, which has that many. Mm. Yeah, nice. Piccadilly Circus, yeah, yeah absolutely right. It. Is that five that's at Piccadilly Circus? I think six. I think it's... Again, yeah, look at this, lot, you were talking it? about your, uh, the, the marks on the back of the tile. <coughs> yeah, and again, here's something we've seen before, Alex. Do you remember when we were at Archway, there was that wooden Wood. baton uh, that looks like it might have been 
added later, perhaps? I don't know. It's very strange. It's um, almost like it was put there to stop the tiles slipping. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? It's but like you'd like normally you take it away after you'd yeah. installed the tiles, absolutely. wouldn't you? Well, that's, a good drop. That, that's a great suspense question, Siddy. I'm going to fly it over the top and find out. The bottom of it is... Whoa. That... <laughs> okay, we haven't seen that before. That's the foundations of it, right? Those are cable tunnels coming out from them. Yeah. What? There's a lot of dust. It's a lot. That, of it's a lot. It's a lot, that's for sure. It's so... Train. It's a big station there, right? I yeah. mean, two abandoned lift shafts. Well, actually, tiny at street level, huge yeah. down below, you know? Mm. There you go. Mm. Never judge a book by its cover. Exactly. Yeah, you never can tell. Let's carry on, guys. Look at this. Even more tiles, even more bits of... It's funny how the dust has been moved around as well. It's a bit yeah. less kind of... Assault on the sensors down here, isn't it? So go on, what have you found? Look, you can see this must have been where the spiral staircase was mm. because you can see the tiles oh, up the wall. Beautiful. Where it would have been. Look at this. Jeez. Look, have a look at this, Doug. Wow. You've oh. literally got. Look at it. That is tremendous. So you've got the beautiful keystone over the uh, over the top of the, the doorway there. You've got these. I mean, the pattern's very much like Down Street, isn't it? Yes. Uh, just different colour. Obviously, uh, not not red, but brown. But also, uh, on the other side of that, guys, look how clean the tiles are. <laughs> it's a lot clean. Oh, we can get across. If you ever want Brilliant. Down, look at that. Oh um, I'll tell you what I'd there. like to do is just show everybody uh, what's up at the top. You know when we were at the top of the vent shaft yeah. and I was saying, oh, look at all that rough shuttering? We've got the same thing there. Well, They've kind yeah. of rounded the it off. The tiles go all the way up is just phenomenal, isn't it? Wow. Let's have a look over here, look. Mind these wires. There's a big hole in the middle. Look at this, guys. So this is the other side of the passageways out of the lift. Welcome to the other side. Look. I mean, blimey, look. We've got some light down here. Oh, wow. Oh, look at the tiles, though. They're not That's even so dusty. Cool. Whoa. They're not even dusty on this side. I, I have to say at this point, we should apologize to the viewers. Just, I think we have overused the word wow, but I'm not uh, quite sure what else to, to use, Genuine frankly. excitement. It's, Can we give us some color through there? Yeah. Look at that. How's that? Is that all good? Just look at the quality of these I know. The, They're, um, the color is amazing. I, but just like the feel of it, it's barely chipped. It feels 17 like... 17 years use. This is all it has. I, I mean, we have I to remind so, ourselves, don't we? This has been here for 150 I mean, the layer of grime on top is incredible, isn't it? Have you got your big fat torch? I do. How's that? Is that too yeah. much? No, 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 BFT. It's great. It's great. <laughs> Indeed. BFT roll. But I mean, look at those. I mean, uh, there's a lot worse out there on the system, isn't there? I mean, those are... Oh, did you hear that? That was like a door slamming. Yeah. <laughs> the preservation's <laughs> incredible. Yeah, I think we're back to the sitting around the camp telling ghost stories, mm. aren't we? Hey, yeah. Um, da, 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 da. Oh, insulator. porcelain insulator. Yeah, it's a decent neck, isn't it? I'm, ju I'm just blown away stop? by this. A doorstop. Very, <laughs> very trendy one. Let's have some more light, guys. What we got down here? <clears throat> no, those ones don't work. We got any beans? To be Ooh. fair, the yeah. area manager did say it... we don't have much lighting down there. To which Sid oh. and I replied, "That is exactly what we need for these guys. episodes." Guys, I'm just looking at these tiles. They've um. They've gone that uh, shade of uh, what we refer to as Fagnolia yeah. on the, uh, almost like they've had a wash of something, or maybe, look maybe it's tobacco. I don't think it would be. It sort of looks like a wash. Yeah. It's, it's very odd. Paint, really. It's very odd. Come on then, let's yeah? do this. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. Oh my goodness, look at this. So we are now going over a running one. Because we've got these. Um, the yeah. This is something else, isn't it? I mean, I don't, how do you feel about this, Lord? What do you think? I'm just, I'm just absorbing the the difference in the areas. It's very spooky. Yeah, and how. Do you know, 
everywhere. It's, actually, it's not that bad. Yeah, it it's it, not, it's it was a lot here. worse when we were in the spiral stairs. So you can see, I mean, yeah. there's less particulate than you normally get on the tube. I, I feel think. like something's happened at surface level and we're like four survivors and we're kind of going through the kind of wreckage of what's happened. Do you know what I mean? Like life's moved on, but there's spaces <laughs> kind of encapsulated. This week Can we've gone somebody... dystopian. Yeah. <laughs> we're in a post-apocalyptic movie. Do you know, yes. It's really weird looking at this station through the viewfinder because you suddenly realise I feel like a viewer opposite the station mm. rather than a, you know, an explorer to grand right. grandise us. <laughs> You know, this is, this is astounding. And as you just mentioned, City, just a second ago, this is what a station looks like when they take the platform away. Because this is, you can see the drop down, they would have taken Gosh. the platforms away so the trains can run faster through this oh. station. So on the other side, yeah. do you see? They I actually do. have stairs down. Right. Well, then we know where we need to go. It's quite fun. Just so do you reckon we do one on the other side now? Getting some yeah. shots. So, oh. This is phenomenal. Isn't it? Oh, this one's got lights. This is good. Okay, so I'm guessing we've got a little bit of time before the next train. So let's just do the scan while we can. Oh, look at that. That's incredible, isn't it? Oh, I think we might need to yeah, go to the other side. Yeah. Oh, I think we should do one more train here. Yeah. Uh, it's been quite a nice regular service, hasn't it? Yeah. Well done, Northern oh. I'm feeling a little bit dusty. It is a little bit, isn't it? You can feel it on your skin, can't you? Shower time. Hammer time. time. <laughs> Jinx. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty awesome, right? I just um <laughs> I didn't realise we'd be that close to um Yeah. So the um, track the I think we should. It's probably worth just saying why this isn't going to be a Hidden London tour. Uh, <laughs> how many <laughs> reasons do you need? <laughs> I'm guessing you've probably already realised that as we've come down, but uh, maybe some access, respiratory issues. <laughs> yeah, the access, the proximity to the track. The uh, new platform. But it's yeah. only because we've been trained that we're allowed even down here. Yeah. This is so primitive, this one. Well, it's so close to the track that you have to have uh, a basic track awareness license, which we yeah. all do. We all have the card. Um, right then. Can we go on the other side? Let's do it. Now, I no. <laughs> cannot quite get over what I'm seeing down here. I really can't. Cool. This is probably the quietest you've ever seen me, isn't it? It, it is. I, I think we're all just kind of stunned a bit into silence by the experience. I'm, gonna, I'm just going to say this one more time. This station was only in service for 17 years. This is why this place is so preserved. There are so many wonderful moments in here as we've walked around. There's no way in the world anyone could ever come down here as a member of the public, but to be brought down here as a member of staff is such an incredible privilege, and I'm so glad that we're able to share this with you. This has got to be one of the highlights of that. I, I totally agree. I, I, don't, I think we've all just kind of experienced that moment of 
uh, an assault on the senses. It's done silence. And we haven't oh, done one like this for quite a long time. This well, is the real been, deal, isn't it? Been, no, no, no. But I mean, we haven't been to a station that's done this to us uh, yeah. for quite a while because yeah. we have been to a lot of the others. Uh, but this York one, genuinely not. I have to say, York Road is a bit like this. Yeah. But this one is very, I think because, and I know the area really well as well, Kentish Town, the whole area is my family's stomping ground. And obviously, in all of my family's lifetime, this station would have been shut, having opened. I mean, this is the thing, it was, it was mm. deemed important enough to have a tube station, and then it only lasted 17 years before they thought, not enough people are using it, they shut it. Well, I think uh, it's time to... Uh, See the girls. Yeah, because one of the things with this place is we're all off running around, Yeah. because uh, it's just impossible not to want to explore. I'm going with a firm nine out of 10 so far. It's, it's hitting the high rolling scores. Considering at the top I was a one, because <laughs> it was so breezy and uh, cold. But actually, it's uh, above expectations. Very unlike we've been in any space before. Right then, come on. <laughs> Still exist. Mind is the blown. <laughs> I mean, that is, it does just look like uh, there's been bomb damage, doesn't it? <laughs> so yeah. like a, uh, 250 pounders have kind of gone straight through the, uh, like the bottom. Oh my God, it sounded like somebody, don't you think? So we have just found a poster fragment and there's not much left. Your sanitary inspector can. In red. Yeah, and then but, something about the. So it's bugs, hatch. This has got to be a. Okay, this has got to be something to do with wartime shelter and about bed bugs, right? Yeah. Oh, and look like, yeah, this is like a typical kind of uh, mattress that people bring is. down and yeah. shelters. Yeah, like those them. ones we've seen in the photos no at Cutting Sound. So you, you, your, your bunk disinfected. disinfected. Furniture, here we go, bugs. Dark. In, in plastic. In dark places, perhaps. So That's hang on, bugs yeah, live. No, no, I'm looking at yeah, bugs, bugs live, live. Oh. In, in dark place. Oh, there it goes. Uh, so bugs hatch take from something like five days, maybe. Yeah. Um, this looks like some kind of vehicle here. Yes, it does. Laundry wagon, is it? Yeah. Oh, hang on. It's talking about Sanitary. disinfecting. Oh. So maybe it's a deinfestation wagon or something. And then we're really starting to run out down here. So hang on. In. What could that be? In, in, in plastic. plastic. In crates, cradles. Oh, it's probably about be careful with your bedding. So in plastic. In your sanitary inspector, inspector can. can. Got that bit. Probably I mean. something. Oh, right. So basically, it's, 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 what it's telling do. you about what, what will happen with bed bugs in sort of their life cycle and how they'll hatch. And then what your sanitary inspector can do to pre prevent it yeah. while you're maybe, sheltering. So maybe they put it through this kind of dis disinfect. Yeah, well, they did have. So Clapham South had a yeah, deinfestation yeah. station there. And then put that into crates with, with plastic. plastic. And um, at the top, presumably, it said bed bugs. Yeah. <laughs> you can see a bee. Yeah. 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 Wow. wow. I, I want to see if I can track that post. Original, down. right? Yeah. And there you go. Look, so I tell you what, look, if you just take the torches off it, because yeah. all of that was far too glary for camera, and we'll just let the viewer see all of that lot. So there we are, B for bed bugs, and then your, uh, not, not too close, your sanitary, sanitary inspector, inspector can. can. Bugs hatch take from five, and then, oh, that says furniture. Yep. Uh, and bugs, bugs in dark. dark. And then we're not quite sure what that says. In cra, in plast. I wonder if it's to do with plaster, them sort of Let's being in the see. walls or something. Let's but just see. Yeah, amazing. In cracks in what plaster. A, who spotted that one? Me. Well done, City. Good eye work. Let's carry on then. <laughs> okay. This. Eye work. Right. Well, um, another Simpsons. So, oh, we saw that one on the way in. Yeah. Right. Mind the pipe as we come out. Time to do the other bridge. Well, 
well done. I did say keep an eye out for wartime stuff and you delivered. Just, just before we hop down, I've just spotted these. I don't know if you've seen them very well on mm. camera. Oh, we've seen those before as well. Uh, addition at Down Street yeah. um, for sewage ejector yeah. vacuum pipe. So it's like a, you know, about that gauge. Glad uh, I touched that then. Yeah. <laughs> it was a uh, sewage one. No, I know. But, I know. but um, well, it might, what I'm thinking is if it, was, if it did have a wartime conversion, mm. then why not? That would you know, oh. bring the sanitary stuff back up from the platform. And then you've got, you see them, they're just going down the wall there, back towards what would have been the sump. So interesting, don't know what they were for, but. Ooh, wow, atmospheric. Wow, oh, our favorite sign, yeah. showing that steam trains are running on the tube. <laughs> Gets me every time. And look, we've got oh, steps. Be careful. Oh, I won't. I'll be careful. Oh, my goodness. Oh, oh look. Oh, my God. Look. Wow. Oh. Right. What? It's another cliffhanger. Oh, my. Look at this. Have a look at this, Nixie. There's another oh, my poster. word. That's really complete, isn't it? Look at okay. that at the top. It's a I mean, it's gross, but wonderful at the same time. I mean, it just goes to show, for anyone who didn't really study World War II, there was something pretty awful about the living conditions, wasn't yeah. there? It really you was. We've had bed bugs, scabies. Had head lice. Ooh, I got head lice once when I was a kid. We all did. I haven't. Oh, OK, well then you look. A bit pure. Um, <laughs> yeah. So I particularly love the bit that just says, a the louse down at the bottom. <laughs> Here we go, another one. So we've had scabies, well done. That's yet another bit of evidence of human habitation down here for sleeping. Have a look at this as Wonder well. This... Something that we saw, Sid and I were just having a look on the other platform. Mm. And you can imagine, you know, for a, an underground system which is very, very careful about which typeface it uses. Uh -huh. Have a look at this. Just a gentle reminder, during wartime, don't smoke. Oh. Look at that. Yes, that's not, that's not our typeface. No. Can we, have we got the big torches? Look down there. Yeah, we're back. between trains, so let's just give that the beans. Cool. <laughs> that's, uh, that's quite something. Let's just have a look that way. Wow. What else is That is dusty down here, guys. I think that might be... Uh, look around here again, Nixie, with the big one. <laughs> Torch. Look at that. We should come here at during engineering hours to properly explain. Oh yeah, that is a very good thought. There must be on the wall. I there could... must be. I bet they've been painted. Out. They have been painted. They out. have. But the okay. tiles um, themselves would have said Castle Road. Oh, well, th that for me is the clincher. The the painting over the tiles is a classic wartime thing to make it look more civilian and less station. Would they have also done um, that when they stopped using the station? Do they do they, oh no, they don't do it automatically. No. They'd only do it for, you know, if for that change of purpose. And that with the signage, there we go. Well, there well we go. That is what an astonishing place. Something. Can I just say, I have a really good suggestion for what we should do next. Yeah. Leave. Should we get the pub? Motion accepted yeah. and seconded. Like to go and just have a drink <laughs> or something really. Oh. And well, there we are guys, South Kentish town. Um, every bit as mesmerising as I hoped it would be, actually. Um, well, I'm more so. More I mean, so. I wasn't expecting this. Yeah. I'll be honest. Something else. And Laura, you said from ground level, it was pretty unremarkable. I think it's actually quite nice from above ground, but... Yeah, I think it... <laughs> well, we, it was raining. I think it was more the, yeah, just the, the just whole environment of the entrance. And I don't think I was expecting it to be quite so exposed on the way down. But for me... I think sometimes it's the quiet ones that speak loudest. Mm. Well, it's, it's remarkable, and actually, it stunned us all into pretty much silence as well, which is I a really interesting thing. And 
And I've always wondered about this site because we haven't been here before because um, the surface level building, the ticket pool, and all of what was built here is being used for other purposes. So I, I kind of feel like we, we kind of always wrote it off for. It's a bit like when we visited Archway. It's really nice doing ones that we've genuinely not been into before and having to decode them as you go. We know, obviously, the basics of the history and the, the layout of the station, but, mm -hmm. but not how it, what it's turned into. Yeah. I don't think I've had a personal moment of that, that uh, going into the assault on the census since we did Stockwell. <laughs> Do you remember Honestly, the venture up there? That, that was like I was like being blown away, but you had to hold me. It was, it was weird. Yeah. It was a weird feeling. But so anyway, I'm, I'm still itching from the scabies poster. <laughs> so um, and the bed bugs. Yeah, and all of that, and I'm still marvelling at what there is left. I mean, as I say, I've said it so many times. 17 years service, and this mm. place is still such a time capsule. It's amazing. I mean, it was. It's nearly a hundred. Well, it's 98 years since the station closed. Yeah, and yeah. since awesome. passengers last walked through through these halls, ninety eight years have passed. That's a lot of story. I'm feeling quite emotional. Mm. Is that a little weird? Yeah, I feel, I feel quite <laughs> it's a lot. drained by this. It's a lot. Laura, thank you so much as always for coming grubbing with us as well. All Sitting. good. Thanks, baby. Thank you. And Christopher, thank you so much. Pleasure. As always, find us on Instagram, Alex Grunton, Chris Nick, City Holloway, Hidden London Law, and at LT Museum. You've obviously found us on YouTube. Thank you very, very much indeed. Like, subscribe, and comment down below. Thank you. And we'll be back in another amazing location under London sometime very, very soon. Have yourself a great day and stay safe. Let's go. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> wine. Extra. I want wine.